Oh my god! Is that hands? That is hands! That is hands, people. That is like human looking hands coming through a mirror. <gasps> Goodbye! Goodbye! Goodbye now! Uh, I was nice coming in here and getting the key. Alright, let's go. Alright. That's a nope situation. Totally nope. Full of nope. Totally not going in there ever, ever again. Alright, let's turn it over. Turn, turn, turn. Turn, Seto. Turn. Thank you. Let's go. Oh, what the hell. Well now, this is a rare treat. It's not every day I chance upon someone. Are you a pedophile? Huh? Whoa. Who are you? Ah! Oh yes, pardon me. I roam these parts in search of unique treasures. Do you have to have a chicken head? And if I do say so myself, you seem to have a few eye-catching pieces. Care to barter, my lad? I really hope this isn't a pedophile, I swear. I'll hit you in the face with a stick! A bamboo stick! I've picked up some stuff, but none of it's that great. Well, have it your way. In honor of this most destined encounter, I have a gift. It's on the house. Oh yay, give it to me, give it to me. Healing candy, yes. <gasps> you are a pedophile! You carry candy and give it to little kids! <gasps> oh my god. When you wear a chicken head, that's even more creepy. Oh, pedophile, pedophile, run! Use this dandy little number to ease your tired, troubled traveling self. Thank you. Sure. Let's just back away quickly. Put Push him into the grabby hands. How about that? And with that, I must be on my way. Until we meet again! Sure, chicken man, sure. He's gone. Who the heck was that guy? A pedophile, maybe. I don't know. That is a much warranted question. Well, regardless of his nature, we too should hurry on our way. Never thought I would come across a merchant with a chicken head. That's kind of strange. Alright then. We're gonna need some healing things whenever bonfires are not available. That's awesome. Alright. That was weird. How does he disappear like that? Is he a magician too? There's no more grubby hands, is there? There's no more hands? Hands, Hannibal. Alright, let me look at my own hand here. There's a crayon candy. Alright. Uh, I don't know exactly how much health it heals, but probably not much since he just gave it to us. So it probably doesn't have a lot of healing powers. Just like some or something. Like maybe 20% or 30% or something like that. Hey, 
welcome back everybody to Fragile Dreams where we left off uh, just meeting a strange merchant person if you can even call him a person he has like a chicken head I don't know if it's like a real chicken head or if it's just like a costume I don't know but possibly a pedophile I don't know but yeah there's the bathroom with the grabby creepy hands in the mirrors nope not going in there ever again <laughs> Not even if you paid me a hundred dollars. Nope, nope. Alright, so we gotta go back to that shutter door. And open it with the key that we have. And I'm sure there's going to be more jellyfish. Woo! The pathetic jellyfish that are entities, apparently. But they just seem like weird jellyfish. Okay. Going this way. Or something. Whoa. Oh. Ah, ah. Yeah. They just respawn. Apparently. This devil giant fish! You die! You die in a fire! And never come back. You die in this fire! I'll throw you in it. Pleasantly. Is this a shutter door? Yes, it is. I believe so. New place. Yes, yes. Okay, now turn. Turn around. There you go. Ahead is the train platform. And beyond that, the tracks. If we follow them, they will lead us outside. Oh, oh no. Another earthquake! If there is a stronger quake, the structure could be compromised. You mean we'll be in trouble? Yes. Grave trouble. We must hurry. But... But what? I sense great danger coming from the platform. Do not linger while traversing. And do not strain yourself. Turning back is sometimes the most appropriate action. The likelihood that you will have a safe passage is... I mean, you'll be fine. <laughs> I'm sure. <laughs> no, you're just lying to make him feel better. Just say the truth, man. <laughs> yeah. Together we'll be fine. Yes. Alright. We'll see about that. Follow the tracks. Oh, fire. Oh, oh. Another man. You can build a fire over there. Believe me when I say that rest and retreat can be heroic in their own ways. That's true. Can't save the world if you're tired. <laughs> Is there a memory over there? <sighs> it's soothing watching the flames. Been playing for one hour so far. Awesome, awesome. Okay, there was some fireflies. Yeah, right here. Mystery item.
Ah. Bonfire it is, then. Uh, is this? Ah, oh, a little duck. How oh, cute. Don't let in any strangers while I'm gone. Okay. Don't worry. Mommy will be back very soon. Uh, has Mommy ever broken a promise to you? Sorry, I accidentally pressed it too fast. Promise. That's right. I promise. Mommy? Yes, sweetie? Come back home quick, okay? No, oh, that's so sad. Just knowing that they're not alive anymore is just so sad. So, so depressing. I'm sorry I pressed it too fast there when the mom was speaking. My finger kind of slipped. I didn't really mean to push that. Well, you got to read it, at least. You may not have been able to hear the voice acting, but... You were able to read it, that's... something. Uh... That... okay. So we're going near the train tracks. And that's where we came, I believe, up, up there. So we need to go over here. And see if there's anything. Oh! There's some doggies! They don't sound friendly. Dogs. Is there something over there? No. Okay. Oh. The dogs are over here. They're in this area. I hope I'm strong enough to fight a dog. A wolf, most practically, I guess. Wow, whoa. There's a lot of them, isn't there? Okay, go! <laughs> oh, God! Oh, no! Oh no! Get up! Oh! Alright. Is that all? Is that it? That's all of them? They're gone now. Alright. Gotta go heal up. I got hit pretty bad. They better not respawn. I swear I'll be so pissed. I'll be so pissed. They were kind of tough. Mm, I see. Old instant lunch. Hmm. Oh, it's HP healer. Oh, awesome. Well, s is, who cares if it's stale? We're surviving here. <laughs> we need to eat something. Those wolves better not still be there. I'll be so pissed. Yeah, the fighting mechanic of this game 
isn't really great, obviously. That's also been in the reviews and stuff. That's mostly the reason why this game has a 6 out of 10. And a 7 out of 10 and stuff. If this game probably would have been rated like a 9 out of 10 or something. Or at least an 8 out of 10 if the fighting uh, mechanic and stuff was good. They're not there, are they? Best not. They best not. Come back. Alright, good. Because I was saying... See, that's what I mean. Every time I lean this way, it like spins around like that. It's so strange. Alright. Now, is there anything... Uh, over... Oh, come on. Go over that way. Over that way, Shoto. Yeah, the controls are a little bit stiff and kind of kind of locked up, like not letting you do much. That's the only real sucky part about this game. But I seriously believe if the fighting was better, the fighting controls, it would be perfect in my mind. It's not going to translate that? Really? Okay, about to say. You need to translate that. Azabudai Nagasakacho Shi Shi Shiba Daima Shiba Diamond Shiba Diamond Hmm. Okay. I don't know what that means. It's something. <laughs> this is the old train, apparently. Okay. We came down from there. This over here. This is where you got your tickets, I believe. Downtown. Yes, yes. All right. Okay, just a red box. Okay. 